All right, what up, babes? So I mentioned $5 a share the other day. So AMC at $5 a share is something that's very possible if Lou from Lou versus Wall Street is correct. The reason being, if they are parking all of our buy orders in a secondary database, these shares are never getting reported to Wall Street or to the SEC or any of those details. So it's not affecting the price that would go upward or the price action rather. So they're only reporting our sell orders, which drives it down and the orders that are being ping-ponged back and forth. Those are the few shares that these hedge funds actually own, and they're using a computer which trades and transfers these trades, these shares pretty much back and forth from one another. So with that being said, they're adding more shorting action than they are buying action, driving that price down, and it's synthetic. None of our actual shares, the ones that you and I have purchased, are actually hitting the market. So they're not affecting the price, meaning that no matter what we do, we can't stop it from inevitably going as low as two, three, four, five dollars a share. So if that happens, don't be scared. Just buy more because the moment that they turn off this machine and they actually acknowledge our orders, the only way that this price can go is up. Now, I'm not going to be here and tell you, oh, it's going to be $100, it's going to be $1,000, $500, $1,500, $5,000, 10000 10, That's for you to decide. That's for nobody else to tell you, but you to determine. Don't look for a leader like Lou said. He's 100% right about that. You be your own leader. Figure out when you are going to sell your shares, but use this opportunity to buy more up. Widen your position because guess what? If it doesn't go to your dream, $10,000 a share, $100,000 a share, but you've widened your position enough that it does make an impact on your life, you'll be able to compound those plays. And what that means is use your earnings to make a bigger earning in the future.